Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Mech Warrior 5 modded and I can't even say a word, that's a good start, but that's nothing new. But what is new is there is a rare King Crab. It is a very good King Crab. It uh, has six ballistic points, but currently it, when bought it comes with two LBX 10s. Which is going to be very interesting, but what more importantly, it comes with endo assaults and a double heat sink kits built into it. I have sold a bunch of stuff, a lot of stuff, and I've sold a lot of uh, a few of the mechs. I think that Jaeger mech I sold, and the fire starter, and that blackjack, maybe, possibly. Can't remember. But we're definitely going to be buying this King Crab because we're not, it'd be stupid not to, basically. We'll get a little bit of price off, which is awesome. And let's quickly take a look at this. So yes, all arm-mounted ballistic points. I'm probably going to leave it like with these for now, but I just want to have a play with how many AC twos. Ah, we are way over tonnage. There is SRM ammo in here. Where's the SRM? There's two of zero. Okay, revert back. Why does it have SRM ammo? Am I being stupid? It doesn't have the standard King Crab has a missile hard points there on the uh, left shoulder. This one doesn't, but it has the SRM ammo. Now, good thing is, that means I can take those off. Weird thing as well, it's... Why? So it obviously has no... This is obviously just a, a bug, basically. Or they haven't Bit of, um, sorted this out, but it's showing that it has two lasers, but obviously there clearly isn't two lasers on here, as well as the two other things. Um, what is A? Okay, so it has no weapon loadout. No, it's not weapon loadout. It's um, what do you call it? I can't remember. We'll sort it out in a second because I need to do that outside of here. Uh, I've got no other LBX ammo. I don't think I need any cooling on this. And that's where the LBX 10s probably will come undone because I'm thinking I would love to put four Ultra 5s on here. We probably possibly could do it. But I'm thinking AC 5s. Of which I only have one AC5. That's because I'm picking mech parts too often, basically. Uh, there is one here. I could also put double. Not probably not long tom. Possibly sniper. Fifteen tons. Actually, probably not. How many shots though? Forty. Maybe we just leave it as it is. How much is that saving us? Five, five tons, is that it? That is it. That's a lot to take that out. So we're gonna revert that. And if we max the armor, it's only half a ton. So, one and a half tons to play with. Ah, oh, I purchased that by mistake. Oopsie. Never mind. I'm going to put... No, hang on. Hmm. Okay. I swear I could put a heat bank in another mech. 
Also, probably we should move some of this around a little bit. So we're half ton over, but I think we can possibly just shave some down. That's probably going to be good enough. Yeah, there we go. That'll do. That's fine. Three days of work. Doesn't have an SRM-6 equipped. Okay, well... I'm pretty sure one bit is not going to help us. Yeah, it's not giving me the option to put it in. So, there is no SRM-6. Clearly there is no SRM-6. And, yeah, we're just going to start the work. But one thing I will do is... Weapon groups. See, it's not there, so it definitely is broken. That's fine. That is totally fine. And one other thing I want to do on the weapon grouping, actually, is have... It's set up like that. There we go. Awesome. So we have our first assault mech. We are going to test that out today, and we are going to push the boundaries by going up to Formopoli and having a dual contract in Formopoli. Exactly 20 days away. It's not like this was planned. Not entirely. I did plan to go there, but I didn't know how long it would take me to refit the King Crown. So, uh, let's see. I mean, 340 drop tonnage we've got to play with. 24 salvage we've got to work with. And I am going to drop you and I am gonna take the new King Crab. It still says that we're running weapons with no ammo but that clearly is not the case. Well, I wonder if those imaginary weapons are actually taking up tonnage. Interesting they may well be possibly and do we have I mean, the Jaeger mech needs a double heatsink kit. The Warhammer possibly works better now. I don't know about the quick draw. Possibly works better now. But what are you running? You're basically the smaller version of the quick draw, and you. We'll get swapped out for the Warhammer. Yeah, see how that works. Cool. We're a little bit under tonnage, but so be it. And I hope everyone enjoys the video. If you do, remember to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and we shall see how this King Crab wrecks or not. So it's not showing on the bottom left of the weapon groupings, so still thinking they don't exist. I might actually take a look at uh, Sala.net for the King Crab 010 to see whether what it comes with on there. Because it might be that it doesn't on there or does come on there. And we shall see whether this mech is broken or it is correct. You know, it's not showing the weapon systems or it is showing the weapon systems. We have 240 rounds of ammo. That is going to be a lot of ammo that we're going to punch through enemies. But we've already got two weapons. That kind of makes sense. Uh, I know they're behind the hill. I'm thinking they've gone the opposite way around the hill. Kind of maybe should go up the hill so I get height over them. There they are. Ooh. Okay. Yes, yeah, take out the weak guy. Let's take out the small guy. That's a freaking Atlas, I've just realized. Oh, the 
Quintra is getting ripped to pieces Tango once again. I really am lacking firepower, I must admit. It feels like. I don't want to hit him in the head. Did I get him in the head? It's somewhat in the head. No. He goes his arm. Ah, he's done around. It's annoying. Ooh, they're having a punch fight. Right, he's gone. And the last one is the Battle Master. Actually, apart from the initial damage that the Redraw took, we're good so far. Matsu. Okay, take off the arm, get rid of the PPC. I mean, it's still got six medium lasers, which is insane. Uh, got him in the face a little bit. Ooh, we got a headshot. Right, go for that, and I'm going to pick up some goodies. If you find the acquisition, just walk up to it in order is this to pick a, it up. Is this a different one? I'll take a look in a second. I mean, it's three on one over there. We should be good. I am looking very broken. Oh, I didn't actually... Ah, oh, there is two. Um, I didn't actually pick this one up. There we go. Excellent find, Commander. Ooh, they've got headshots on the Thunderbolt as well. 51,000 Seabill, that's all that was. Alright, the Black Knight is looking a bit broken. That's because they're kind of dancing. I think I headshot him as well. That may be a problem in the fact that we don't get any salvage of the Atlas because we won't be able to take all of the Atlas. Um, in terms of... Oh no, wait! Ah... Oh. So that one is headshot. Can't take it. So yeah, if I headshot the Atlas and it appeared here at 50 um, share cost of salvage rights, I won't be taking it. But because it's broken and down here, I get... Uh, there's also battle master parts. I mean, I'm going to take... 13 parts of it and then three there we go we'll do that looking good I mean the dervish is also a pretty good pickup but we're looking for assault mechs so we shall take the assault mech parts you your leg got broken that's why you took so much damage and my it was just my torso that took damage there. I'm actually maxed out on skills. My so my commander is maxed out on skills. We cannot take any more. The arm got broken there, so I may have lost a weapon system there. Let's take a look at a second. Uh, Twenty six days of repairs. That's fine. Three days. Uh, Twenty four days. Did we lose any weapon systems? No. Twenty eight days as well. And just out of interest. Champion Cicada Jenna Rifleman. I mean, if we got it earlier on, I love a Rifleman. But we don't didn't get it earlier on, so so be it. And yeah, we're in a war zone, so that's not going to be there. Okay, let's go to... No, I want to go to Contracts. Uh, objective Raids, 340 difficulty. Let's go for more Salvage. And we'll take the same lance, just got to wait 28 days. Yeah, that's fine by me. So yeah, I like the King Crab. It's not... I need to get the rate of fire up, I would say. So that I can 
do more damage per second. Because otherwise it's very slow damage and but when it hits it's a lot of damage. So Maybe some upgrades after this mission is probably what we're gonna do, I'd say. Yeah, upgrades for the kick crab. I can't do too much because I've got that much money. But we sh I don't actually know if I've got any ballistic upgrades. But I never got into heat problems in the last mission. So heat is not an issue, but it's never going to be an issue. We are going to have to look at trying to find some AC-5s. Okay. Uh, I hit tree on the tank. And oh, he's sitting still. Not anymore, he's not. Right on cue. Veto on approach. Okay. I want to pick up this. Ready to start pickup operation. Thank you. Package acquired. Right, we need to pick up Watch this item. Targeted asset. Move up to it, and we'll begin the recovery procedure. Oh, there's loads of this thing. It's okay. That's good. Yeah. So far, tanks is all we're fighting, which is really bad considering I want assault max. Target loot. That's this. Then there's another thing over there that I'm going to pick up. Oh, that was 10,000 sea bills. Was that actually what we needed? I think it was. I guess because it's gone from here. Or maybe it just was money thereafter that we're taking home with us. I was just going to say, I hear some VTOLs coming in. Brilliant. Payload acquired. I don't know if I hit it, but I definitely took it down, helped take it down. And let's keep going then. Taking out turrets along the way. Get it. Still didn't get it. The okay, problem with having only oh my good god, only cluster. We're basically only doing the splash damage, not solid hit damage. And therefore, we can't even take down VTOLs quickly. Oh, I think I hit a tree. Oh, no way, I hit my Black Knight because he stood in front of me. You got another one. Okay, we can't get that guy because we don't have the pinpoint of damage. I think we got the VTOL mission, no, Cantina mission complete though, so that is a good thing. By those things, we're going to have a lot of salvage as well. There's another one there. ER Large Laser Short Burst Tier 4. Hell yeah, that's some good equipment. It's, like it's going to be hard to tell when there's this many whether I've collected things or not. So it is what it is, and I actually can't see a lot of what they're firing at. So I shall just do my own thing, let the AI pilots do what they do, which is occasionally do something useful. And I just basically, I'll just lumber around slowly because I'm only doing 48 kph. Vitals, I hear them. Can't 
can't see them. Ah, there we go. Off the list. Ooh, it's an actual mech. Target. You're down. That's a crab. Yeah, definitely to increase rate of fire. New target crap. It's not a new target. Oh, I'll take out you though. Are you down? Alright, while the crab does its weirdness, I'm going to pick up this. There we go. Where did he, oh, there he is. I'm just going to shoot through all the buildings because I'm an ass. Have I actually only gone through less? Those ones that are not showing up are actually just refilling my ammo, aren't they? That's why I'm not seeing anything on the screen, it's because they're just refilling my ammo. I'm, gonna say, I'm pretty sure I've fired more than. Tw less than 20 shots so yeah uh, I kind of wish well restocking ammo is not so bad in the middle of a fight but One of our assigned targets is flying in there it goes have I got just one more to go I do right Another VTOL coming in, but hopefully someone will turn around and take it out. Because I'm just going to ponder forward. Can't believe that we only took on two mechs in this entire engagement. I hit more VTOLs. Yeah, there they are. It's gone and there's no Vex again. I'm literally just hitting trees there, aren't I? Dropship coming in. Let's see what gets dropped. A stalker. New target, stalker. Yeah, go for the stalker. He's the bigger threat. Centurion, actually. Target, Only needs to lose one thing. And he's completely useless. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, the quick draws took a lot of damage again. Okay, so I'm not happy with the quick draw and how much damage it actually takes. So, yeah, we're not, I'm not liking that quick draw really, but uh, how do we make it better? Give it a bigger engine maybe? Make it a brawler, put SRMs in there so we can continue firing close quarters. 
I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all. I'm thinking the SRMs would work, but then you basically you're never using LRMs really. Yeah, turret smasher, and then. I mean, I'm clipping it, and I did it, took it out, but if I was firing solid projectiles, I'd have taken that tank out a lot quicker. Okay, so we made it through. A job well done, Commander. Stand by for pickup. There's pickup. Right, so what equipment did we actually salvage? LRM uh, 15 tier 2, ER large laser short burst tier 4, medium rifle tier 2, and three bins of SRM ammo. Not bad, not bad. There is a full stalker, but can't actually salvage it. Low, well, you know what? Sod it. The AC2s, do I take, oh, I might as well take them just to have fun with them. AC5s, the eight tons. I don't know if I can put four of them on the, but I'll just give it a try. Yeah, I wanna put four on the, King Crab and you lost a heat bank three. You are not doing so good for me. Wow. Yeah, I'm not sure why it's it's failing so much. Apart from like I said. I mean, if I put two, ooh, I could put, ah, I can't put, can I put an SRM 6 stream in there? I can't, so the Artemis just takes an extra slot. I could put SRM 6, uh, SRM 4, would rather prefer a SRM 6. Gives us 10 extra tons. If I drop those for... Maybe a... Not... I think a binary laser would work actually. I got two of those ER large laser short burst tier fours. That would work, two extra tons. No, I kind of want to put the binary laser in there. I'm going to stick with another one of those and I got two more tons that way. I do a lot more damage. So that is 200, no, that's structure. Where is Alpha Strike damage? Ah, we have no damage on these. That's right. Also, we don't need that much. So, is there half a. <laughs> no, there's not half a bin of SRM ammo. Damn it! Ah, that sucks. So for max armor, we're a little bit under. And... I don't really want to risk that in here. So we'll do that. And... We'll have to see how that goes. Because we can start shutting enemies down now with that. 
if that doesn't work, we can just go with SRMs and it will just rip things to pieces. But the binary laser gives us a big punch of damage. So, 123 days. I probably don't want to be doing that here, do I? It's not going to cost me that much, though. Um. Ah, the upgrades are the next thing I want to do. Ooh, Hero Mech. Okay, we're going to run down here and then we're going to find another duel. If there is one. There's a duel up there on Concord. Actually, there's something else that I can do. Claim that. Yep. And... Star map. Yeah, we're going to go... Well, we're going to go via here. And then we're going to go see what the hero mech is. So, it's a rare Victor, the 9S. It's actually not that great. 9B. So, what's so rare about it? It's just in pristine condition. Okay, that's fine. Equipment. Heat bag. Nothing there. Uh, I'm never finding anything good on equipment wise. Binary lasers are now coming in tier fours quite regularly. Barracks. No one there, okay. Weird. Yeah, we're gonna go here and see what the hero mech is. Not that I can actually afford it, but who knows. I might sell everything. It's a hero battle master. The Gehi. It's got the Salt Pharaoh. Is that the only thing that it's got? It's got the standard 340, one double heat sink. Sorry, double heat sink kit, six double heat sinks, and then the Pharaoh Salt. How much is it? Uh, 14 million. Wow, there is a Marauder. Well, it's an 85 ton mech. I don't think I'd be able to afford it. I'd have to sell pretty much everything I've got to get another 10 million. Well, it's not impossible for me to get. I might be able to do it. Especially if I sold the Phoenix Hawk, the Cobalt. Sold it. Yeah, let's try for it. That's 1.8 million. It was, um, we are kind of looking for mechs with engines still. That's 12 million, actually. We could do We're going to do this. Easy. Uh, you get 600,000. And we're about there, really. I just sell you two, and we're good. So, yeah, we've got another assault mech. So, we got a hero mech this time round. So, we're going to purchase it. And I actually quite like a Battle Master because it has all the laser points. But I'm going to ditch those two. And we're going to go with ER Large Laser Short Bursts. Those are going to become the better just tier four ones. There we go. Now I'm thinking. We got three. We've got four tons left over now because of these guys. Oh, it's running streaks. So what is the difference between streaks? Short range missile system that fires two guided missiles can only be fired with missile lock. Ah. That makes it useful. Or 
or it says one and a half tons. So let's take that out a second. That's Artemis. Do we not have any SRM Artemis ammo? Apparently we don't. Okay. That is fine. Three SRM sixes leaves us with half a ton. We don't have half a ton of ammo, but we want more than that anyway. I'm thinking maybe the Street Twos are a way to go. And then put one more double heatsink in there, and. Well, let's max the armor. Ah, point one, which means it's going to be an odd number. Damn it! And then I can put uh, heat bank in there. Oh no! Wait. No wait. I doesn't. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. It's already a heat bank in there. What if I took a so heat capacity is 62, if I put one of those in there, 77, 72, that's better, that is better, yes. The only thing that's missing is sensors, but we'll get that later on, and... thinking these will work for now, but maybe uh, once I've tried them out, I will have a go at putting bigger SRM launchers in there. But I'm thinking taking the endo off the King Crab might be useful. But that is that done. Uh, yeah, let's repair everyone. Has no ammo, we know that. It's broken. Right, King Crab needs upgrades. And he can be a juggernaut. Ballistic range and velocity. Weapon damage. Ballistic damage 1.3 million. We can't afford that. Uh so that's 300,000. Let's see if there's Mystic Cooldown. That works. Yep. Don't need heat. I don't need anything else. Okay. That's fine. We'll do that. We are running low on uh, money, but it's all good. We're going to go get some more money with one final Hero Mech. Damn it. No. No, no, no. Up to Concord, I believe it was. And there is, or was, a dual mission. Oh, we're in debt! Oh no! Um, we have a centurion, we've made money. <laughs> Whoopsie! That went wrong. Four mission operation, garrison duty and objective raid. Okay, so... I was wrong, or it's moved, or it's... There's a dual contract. Yeah. Let's go there. So the King Crab can go anywhere. Basically, can... Uh... Large Chem Laser Tier 3... S oh, that's not... Bad, we got two of them already. Large chem lasers. Might want to build something with that actually at some point. So we'll take that. Not that I'm um, too worried about that just yet. But let's go do the duel. And we want all the salvage because I want to see if I can get the an atlas. Area is under heavy weather warning. It's going to affect visibility and sensors. And where is it? Battle Master with too heavy. Okay. I want to give the Battlemaster a go. 
I'm thinking we drop the Warhammer to a The Jägermank. No, no, to a griffin then. You. Yes, there we go. That'll do. So hopefully there is one more Atlas that we can fight and therefore take some more salvage home with us. And just before we do anything, weapon groupings. Uh, not too bad there. Three, four... Yep, yeah, that'll do actually. That will be fine. You must shoot. You have been shot down on your way to the mission. Survive until the dropship is repaired. What? New target stalker. Okay. Bottleneck is marked for destruction. That is interesting. Okay, a little bit too far away, I think. Over here, I'm gonna go get you. Just had to get it in gear and start it up. Yeah, come here, little boy, javelin. little javelin. Dropship coming in and is it firing on us or are we firing on it? I saw a laser. I think that's it firing on us. Incoming missile. Okay. Additional bog is setting an intercept course on your position. I see an archer. That is a thug. Ooh. Never seen a thug. We're taking a lot to the center torso. I need to underrun this guy. The thug is going down pretty quickly. New target on Awesome, the thug is down. Oh, we are getting hot drop literally on top of us. And I think uh, one of my mechs has just lost an arm. Oh, good God. That's an Atlas. That's a lot. That's a lot. Uh, I've lost an arm. Uh, I'm gone. I'm down. I can't take on. That is unbeatable. I'm dead. So anyway, that is it for this video. I'm really going to end it on an absolute shit mix of a video or a, on a mission because... <laughs> I don't know what to do about that. That was a lot of enemies, and yeah, I don't like it. But anyway, that was not a dual mission. That was something else. That was an absolute ambush and a half, and we lost, basically. But anyway... That will do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Also, see you next time for some more mech destruction.